All right, uh, about to make this trip out and uh, yeah, I'll find out where I'm going in a second. I'm gonna go check out Slate. Yeah. Go check this place out. It's rather cold, very cold. It's all right though. I'm kinda used to it. Winters are pretty brutal out here in Pennsylvania. I mean, I guess it could be worse. <laughs> Could be like, you know, upstate Pennsylvania, like somewhere in the or like somewhere in the mountains or something like that. No, not for me. <laughs> A little too cold. <laughs> so I gotta walk this trail here. Cause that's how you get to these places. Uh, it's so muddy. It's not bad though. Like, it's not like overgrown or anything. So, that's good. Except for this part. That kind of sucks. Oh well. Oh, here we are. Man. like a shed. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't realize that's all ice right there. Look at this. What the hell? I didn't realize how old this place was, or is. It started construction in 1909, and then uh, it was, uh, it opened up, it was built, and then uh, by 1911, so that's when it opened up. I was gonna see if I could try and get in here, but I don't know. The other part of it. Man, it's cold. Is it like chairs? So much overgrowth. It's like a shed or something, or a garage. Something like that. Spooky. Just a bunch of stuff. Yeah, this place is super old though. I had no idea just how old it was. Um. Like, so yeah, it was built in 1909, 
and then open in uh, 1911 and the I'm not I'm not entirely sure but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that uh the girls and boys were intermixed like they were just going together and then they broke it off into two and that certainly certainly helped um with the population of it there was only 24 women in total or girls i should say going to this to the school Not a lot. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so this this all right here happened from a fire. Uh actually not that long ago. March 29th of 2014, there was a fire on this property and it damaged a lot of these buildings. So that's why they're even more beat up. A fire really messed these buildings up. I mean, you can see right there, it's all collapsed from it. I had no idea about it until recently. This place is really kept under wraps. You don't really hear a lot about it. I know that they discussed knocking it down. Someone bought it for like 12 mil. So. Have to check that out more into that. This is probably all. That looks like fire damage. Yep, you can see the soot still. If you're ever in Pennsylvania to get a chance, come check this place out. It's really cool. And who knows? I mean, it could be haunted. I don't know. You never know. Brand new houses can be haunted, even if nobody died in them. So it's possible. Huh. Onward with this. Man, it is frigid. I know, I'll shut up. I keep talking about how cold it is. But here we go. We're going to go check out this little green greenhouse here. I thought I saw something on the ground. I don't know. This place certainly doesn't have a window left. <laughs> Maybe one right there. It's like plexiglass though. It's like plastic. So yeah, this is like their garden or was. Yeah. Just a bunch of stuff now, a refrigerator. It's pretty cool. I wonder how much it is to have a greenhouse or maintain one it seems like it'd be a lot of work but at the same time i guess like once you get it going i'm sure it's fine <laughs> feeling blue yeah, watch my step yeah there's like so many acres um i want to say 304 
I'm not entirely sure. Um, something like that. There's a lot, a lot of land back here. A lot of places to go. There's probably like, now don't quote me on this because I'm, I'm not sure. But I would say all together, one, two, three, four, five. It depends on what you're, what you're counting to. Six, I, I wanna say there's like, I don't know, 12 to 14 buildings. Something like that. So one thing I noticed is uh, some of these places you can definitely get into, some of them you can't, which is fine. Still spectate from outside. It's still cool to be here. The vibes are cool. It's different, you know, like being here. I mean, you're seeing it on here, but it's just cool. You just gotta come here if you're ever, if you're ever around. So, yeah. It's not, it's not like hard to find. It's not super hard to find. It's not super easy to find either. Um, I mean, it's just Delaware County in Pennsylvania. It's like the Glen Mills area. And uh, you swing down Valley Road, you just keep going and boom. But, you know, I can't give an exact address. That's something you gotta do for yourself, but vicinity-wise, I can help you out with that. So you have this. Man, everything's made out of stone. Man, they don't, architecturally, it's just not the same. Like, these support beams, and and the way things were structured it was just built to last now everything's just like like plat not even pl not plaster plaster is really like drywall like you know sheetrock same difference or stucco but you don't even see really people like using stuff like that it's now it's just like sheetrock <laughs> yeah kind of a walk here but you're not walking far like there's another place right there. Here's the back side of it. It's all boarded up. I'm sure there's a way to get in there. And there is. Bingo. <laughs> Um, the only thing is if you come here at night, I don't know if this is for sure, but I would I just fell. That is all ice there. Oh my God. Oh. That is all ice. And I mean, it is very slippery. Oh my God. I'm gonna just kill myself for real. Um, what was I saying? So yeah, I don't know if this is for sure, for certain, but I was told that you can't come here at night because there's like, silent alarms and their security so wow it's creepy in here what do you think you think it'll work you think the fire escape work <laughs> i'm just playing holy 
bejesus. I didn't think to bring flashlights because, I don't know, I guess in my mind I'm like, it's not dark out, but duh. I'm in an abandoned building. It's gonna be dark. Uh huh. Ow, that hurt you guys. <laughs> That hurt really bad. What the hell? It's like one of those floor cleaning thingies. Man, this place is just destroyed. There's definitely gonna be more footage of this place. I'm coming back here with like, flashlights and all that oh look i found a stairwell that's cool shed some light in here yeah there's other buildings i will for sure check them out wow really okay all right Going this way. Back on the road again. Uh, <laughs> I'm still hurting from that fall. I like stubbed my big toe and I, I thought I was gonna eat shit for sure. I don't know how I managed to save myself, but I could have got, <laughs> I could have gotten mangled just now. Here we are. I think this is the building that's named after George Harrison. I'm almost 100% sure. I know the chapel, or the church. Yeah, the church. Uh, that was named after George Washington. Man, I really had no idea how old these places were. I didn't think they were that old. And this is the place. No, this is not the place. It's a different place. I thought for a minute I went in here, but it's that place that's way back there that I was just in. I remember I was here. I was here, I don't know. It was kind of a while ago now and everything was boarded up. I mean, you couldn't get into any of these places at all. And now, you know, really no problem. Um, where there's a will, there's a way. Someone's gonna figure it out. You know what I mean? I mean, it's just like ply it's just plywood, so it doesn't take much to get that off. But I don't know. I mean, I get it. It's vandalism. <laughs> and now, I mean, it is owned by someone. I wish I could forget. I wish I could remember her name. Forget her name. I wish I could remember her name. But yeah, evidently I don't right now. But, um, yeah, you know, hey, I mean, I'm not condoning it, but I'll just say that I ain't mad at it. <laughs> it's cool you can get in these places. You know, a lot of places you see, a lot of abandoned places, you can't get into them. Or there's security, like, all around the clock. But let's check out some more places. Oh, yeah, you can really see the fire damage. On like the roof, like the edge of the roof, and all the boards, which I'm sure there's a spot that's taken out. Here's the entryway over here. I wish I caught that fall on camera. Like, I, <laughs> I mean, I know it was rolling. But it would have just been so much funnier had it been facing me and I fell. I mean, it, it sucked either way for me, but y'all would have gotten a good laugh. <laughs> this is like the basement of it. Look at that chair there. So you know people are getting in here. Not a whole lot 
lot going on over here or down here just darkness and I mean it's a basement but there is your step down or step up damn fire damage bars on the windows I know the kids that went here were bad. They were like just out of control. It was like, I mean, it was pretty much like an alternative school for bad girls. Bad girls. Like, I mean, everybody knows what an alternative school was. They just didn't comply there. I, I heard incidents about this place. I don't know exactly what's true, um, what's not true. But I heard some things for sure, like teachers getting attacked and I don't know. I, I heard there was a, a death that happened here. Like somebody either, either died or murdered somebody here on this property. And you just never really know, you know, you don't, you don't know for sure. Oh my God, that's freaking me out. Every time I walk, it just sounds like someone was behind me. It's weird, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know but um yeah i i heard that and i i don't know if it's true or not but you know anybody can look up look it up and do extensive search um you know for this kind of thing but all right let's uh, uh enjoy more of this slayton abandoned escapade I did not know what to say. Slayton, Bannon, Abandon, Escapade. Yeah, I keep it real though. Keep it a bean. I just have fun. I love doing this. Huh. I don't know what this place is. I don't remember seeing pictures of this place online. It's like another shed back there uh but like i said there's so much there's so many places on this property so like you know it's just like hard to say exactly how many like yeah i'm here i could go around and count them but i mean i'm enjoying myself i'm not gonna i'm not gonna do that but roughly, let's just say 15 buildings. We'll go with that. God. Yeah. You know what? It's pretty expected though for it to be as messed up as it is. I I expected this. I, it's been abandoned since 2001, so it's a long time. And there it is, the chapel. It's so wicked cool looking. It reminds me of like Man, what does it remind me of? Um, uh, I wish I could remember. Not Resident Evil, but I can't believe I'm blanking on this. They made a video game about it. I don't know. Maybe somebody in the comments can help me out. Normally I would know something like that, but I just can't remember. Graffiti. What's all graffiti? You always see like Bob was here. And then like you know <laughs> I feel like Dane Cook with that whole thing. Cause you see a guy like Bob written there and then someone scribbles his name out and says like fuck Bob. 
I don't know what that, oh, that's a part of a chair. Huh. You know, like one of those desk chairs, school chairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of them. More graffiti, more chairs. So this is, I know, how you get in this place. Just a bunch of random writing, but you know, that's what kids do. Comes to graffiti or men, whatever, I don't know. Gosh dang, it is dark. Man, people really do be coming here a lot. Look at that, just a stack of chairs. in and it is dark I'm not gonna lie it's pretty creepy being in here so I know this place got hit really bad with the fire I was reading about that online. That's creepy. Just a chair. It just looks like a movie set or something. That's what it reminds me of. Huh. What is that? Oh, it's like a stairwell? Oh, that's the grate. Oh God, it is so dark. Yo, it is so creepy doing this. Whoa, I did not see that landing. Super dark. Oh my god. Oh my god. People really ruin this place. It's really got dark. Oh god. Just watch the ground real well if you come here. A lot of stuff on the ground. But look at that, like someone just destroyed that. Like, and the reason why I know this is because I, I was here for a little bit. I got to check this place out, like a little bit, but I was like in a rush. So I didn't really get to enjoy my time and talk to all of you. <laughs> Yeah, someone took their rage out or just was being a jerk. Lots and lots of graffiti. It's just getting dark. I'm on very, I don't have a whole lot of sunlight left here. Not in Pennsylvania, it gets dark like five. And I want to say it's like probably like quarter of five now. But look at this. Man, I'd be so sick to film a movie back here or like shoot a music video. Like do anything really. Like this would look amazing on film. Any of these spots would. Weed. Yeah. Ha <laughs> uh, such a silly goose. Well, yeah, let's go up one more um, flight there. Check that out. And then we will bounce out of this building. All right. 
Yeah, you really gotta be careful. But this would be so sick to film here. Just, I don't know, you could just do anything and it would look awesome. It's because the structure is so old. Like I said earlier, they don't make places like this anymore. It just doesn't happen. It's just like the cost too much and I don't know, a bunch of other reasons why. But I would say cost effectively. Little window. See ya. Wave hi. Oh my God, I'm such a weirdo. You guys will see that. Choked? What does that say? Choked? I wish I could read it. But you see, that's what you're doing. You're scribbling out other people's artwork. It's like the shit I was talking about earlier. It's like some weird design. Fuck. DJY. Whoever the hell that is. And then choked. Choked my faith? That's what it looks like. That's it. definitely what it says. I don't know. I don't get it. Like, graffiti's cool, but, like, why? Just, like, write something and just, like, cross it out. Or just, like, just write, like, Dan is a fucking dick face. Or Mallory's an anus thought. This is come right there. There we go. Awesome. And that's really it. That's it. More ceiling damage. I bet people go to this place and found like, you know, copper, possibly. I don't know. I mean, it is really old, but it would, it would make sense. I used to, uh, I guess I'll answer around for this, but I used to do a lot of um, like construction. Well, I still do, but I used to work on like a lot of old houses in Philly. And um, I don't know, I thought I saw something up there. And uh, like some of those places are so old, like they use, horse hair, hair for insulation. I did not know that until a couple years ago. But yeah, horse hair. Interesting. You know, I actually am feeling a bit warm being here. It's gonna be dark for a second. I wonder if I can go out this way. Nope, that's boarded. Yeah, this is so sketchy. And there's like a platform coming up. There we go. I'm out skis. I'm out skis. Out of, out of here anyway. Whoa, that's cool. I like that. Bone? They just make a huge graffiti thing that says bone. Oh my God, you guys, I gotta bring my girlfriend here. No, I'm just kidding. <sighs> I'm just kidding. I don't date. Bad joke. Very, very bad joke. Man, it sure is creepy as hell in this dang place. Yeah, you can't see shit over there. Oh my god. I made it out alive. I know not yet because I'm not off the property, but... So far, so good. Yeah. God bless. And would you look at that? Someone just had to mess with it. You know, they had to pull, you know, stick poke at priest the priest touched me 
Well, that's Slayton. I'm definitely gonna come back here. I'm definitely gonna make a second half of this video. And I'm definitely, definitely gonna do that soon. And I'm gonna bring flashlights. And uh, yeah, so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, I will be pushing out content at least once a week. Um, I'm going for twice a week. Um, and if I have obviously more time, I'd like to even put more videos up. So, uh, check back with me soon. And, um, yeah, I think it's going to be it. Ooh, a random drink, man, I'm thirsty. Can't go wrong. And it's from Freddy's Burgers. Oh, heck yeah.